I wanted to show you guys what I'm having as a snack. It is Welch's... Really? What's up movie fans? It's Melissa. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello. Welcome. We are continuing our October binge. Watching some spooky movies or some campy horror movies like this one that we're going to be watching. Today I'm watching Rocky Horror Picture Show for the first time. This was suggested to me by somebody in the comments and I know that this movie has a cult following. A few of my friends have seen it and who love it and I've never seen it before. So I know that it's a musical, it's a horror, and it's campy. So I'm hoping to at least be entertained. So let's watch it. If you like this video, remember to like it, give it a thumbs up, and leave a comment because that helps to elevate the visibility of the video. YouTube then will suggest it and then more people will be able to watch and then we can grow the channel. Remember you guys, I'm trying to get to 1k subs so that we can do a live stream. I could interact with you guys. We could watch the Oscars next year together like a watch along or we could watch another movie. I don't know what movie yet but I think that'd be a good idea to do a movie watch along or watch the Oscars together and we could kind of go off on people making off the rail speeches, you know? I want to show you guys what I'm having as a snack. It is Welsh's Berries and Cherries. I freaking love these. Welsh's sponsor me. This is an interesting choice to have the entire opening credits as having the frame just be a mouth singing. I'm not sure if I love that because I think of a musical like Grease, and Grease has a really long opening credit scene, but you're able to see the cartoons go to different places and there's different characters, and this one is like a whole ass mouth full of teeth. I may have to cut this out or not eat the snacks because this bag is kind of loud. I gotta say, so far I don't find Rocky Horror Picture Show soundtrack super catchy don't at me i mean i guess this would be the catchiest song so far is this tim curry finally so far this is the most entertaining character introduction of the movie oh god Why are they just casually disrobing the guests? I liked that point of view shot. Ooh, a mummy! I think I'm sort of waiting to see what is the conflict of the story. Because with conflict, I think that's what makes stories, musicals, whatever, interesting, and then eventually le leading up to some sort of resolution where the story can evolve. Oh, this is the horror part. Oh, snap! At least we got some blood. Oh my god! just a little bit rapey she's gonna do it oh oh my god how could he how could you is she gonna run off with the blonde guy at the end of the movie oh snap ew oh. Mm. I like this shot a lot. I think it speaks to some of the religious undertones of the movie. He clearly sees himself as this creator, this god. He kind of takes all sorts of people into his demented castle and makes them his playthings. I feel like this character comes in with a sort of pitchfork because that's supposed to be representing some sort of devil-ish character that's the end tim curry in the rocky horror picture show 
is the best thing about the movie. I think it took a while for it to get to the main conflict of the story. So I think for me, it just kind of dragged on a bit and I just felt, to be honest, a little bit bored a lot of the times. There were some shots that I found interesting and I thought were good and that I liked that I mentioned throughout my reaction. Tim Curry seems to be the one that is having the most fun and he's the one that is magnetizing. Like your eyes want to be on him to watch him. Yeah, I think, I think he was the best thing in the movie. <laughs> For me, the songs are kind of forgettable. I probably won't think about the songs after this. Knowing that this has a cult following, I can definitely see why it has a cult following. A special group of people like this movie and good for them. Good for them for liking something that is interesting. Let me know how you guys like this movie. Have you never seen this movie either and you're watching it for the first time with me? All right guys, the October binge will continue. The teaser for the next one is a older, older classic film that I'm excited to share with you all. I've never seen it before, but I'm excited to check it out for the very first time and give you guys my reaction.